Hey guys, Saki here from Saki Tech, and in this video, uh, we're going to be talking about the Samsung Galaxy Note 8. So, as you may or may not know, the Samsung Galaxy Note 8 has been announced, and you are going to be able to buy it on September the 15th. That's the street day. So, I watched the press conference where they announced the phone, and the big question immediately arises uh, is the Note 8 a big step? forward is it a big deal or is it just a simple update um, the question is a little bit tricky I would say the answer is yes but it can also be a no based on what you own right now so if you already own a Samsung Galaxy S8 Plus and then if you take a look at the Note 8 you'll see that the Note 8 only has two extras it has it does have a little bit slightly larger screen size but that's not a big deal uh, but the bigger the biggest thing is that it's got the S Pen of course and it's got dual cameras okay so if you you have to carefully analyze uh, whether or not you need the S Pen and the dual cameras or perhaps if not the dual cameras do you need the S Pen uh, that much that you have to get a Note 8 over the S8 Plus again it is essential to understand that the S8 Plus and the Note 8 are basically the same phones all right now i'm gonna end up buying the note 8 it's gonna be my daily driver i do love the s pen i need it i've been missing it since the note 7 uh incident and i'm kind of excited about the cameras okay so the camera that you find on the s8 plus is a very similar camera you find on the s7 edge uh from you know two years ago so seeing an upgrade makes me a little bit excited and camera is one of those things i do use a lot so the Samsung Galaxy Note 8 has two cameras. One of them is a wide angle camera. That's the primary camera. And that's probably almost a replica of the S8 Plus's camera. So they both have the same cameras. Uh, you're gonna get the same quality on either camera. But the Note 8 has a secondary camera. It's a telephoto camera that allows you to optically zoom in two times which comes with some benefits. You can get nice portrait shots and you can also combine the both cameras to get even better looking shots. Now that's gonna be something we have to put to test. But uh, in regards to camera though, I'm just gonna say that the SA Plus has such a world-class camera that uh, the upgrade on the Note 8, even though it is very desirable, it's not something that changed the, changes the game. All right, so the camera, I'd give it 25% weight in deciding whether the Note 8 is better than the S8 Plus, but mostly it is the S Pen. Now, again, the S Pen brings a couple things to the table and they're not, it's not a joke, okay? It brings precise writing, precise sketching, you know, a lot of note-taking capabilities, plus a whole suite of software functionality atop what we already have. Functions that are uh, within the Air Command menu uh, on the Note 8 are functions I can see myself using. And of course, just from my previous experiences, I remember using S Pen all the time to navigate the phone, annotate documents, taking quick notes here and there, and then uh, you know using those notes later. At some point, I'm a little bit of an artist. I have a little bit drawing skills. So at some point, I even used it to sketch some uh, stuff, but that's not a big deal. It is a great thing though, to have that tool in your arsenal, okay? So in that sense, uh, Note 8 is a big step forward. It takes the best phone in the market, the S8 Plus, and it just adds on top of it, all right? And it does it in such a way that the current S8 Plus owners don't have to worry about uh, getting the worst end of the deal because the improvement is on a bottom line level just the S Pen. You still get the gorgeous display, right? Uh, you still get on both of the phones the gorgeous design, you know, the, the dual curved edges, uh, the large and tall display in the front, all glass build with a metal rim around the edges. You still get some of the good features like wireless charging. Um, water resistance and stuff like that. So the phones are quite similar. Now the one thing that is different is the SA Plus has a 35 milliamp hours battery. And finally, we're 100% sure now 
the Note 8 has 3300 milliamp hours battery. The only way to find out which one is better is going to be to actually uh, do some tests. Now there might be some phone improvements on the Note 8 that make it better. So uh, I wouldn't I wouldn't get too mad about that that 200 milliamp hours less battery life if the software has been properly optimized it might yield even longer battery life. Remember the Samsung Galaxy Note 8 is going to be running the Samsung Experience 8.5 software as opposed to Samsung Experience 8.1 or 8.2 on the S8 Plus. So there's certainly some kind of improvement going on on the software end. Again, I haven't got on my hands on the phone yet. As soon as I get my hands on it, there's going to be tons and tons of videos that are going to be dropped, just like the S8 Plus videos. There's going to be comparison videos, there's going to be tips and tricks videos, uh, deep tips and tricks videos, and all that good stuff. So stay tuned for that. But again, just to be very clear, the Note 8 is in fact a big step forward. Why? Because it is an improvement uh, over the best smartphone in the market which is the S8 Plus. It is S8 Plus plus the S Pen which is a superior phone and we're not going to forget the camera. We do have that new dual camera so all that good stuff is exciting. And because of the timeline it's only been six months or five months since the S8 Plus has been out so it's still fresh on the market. It's still a powerful product so the Note 8 is also a fresh and powerful product in that regard. And just to be crystal clear, if you're an S8 Plus owner, you have no desire for the S Pen, there's nothing to worry about. You still have the best phone on the market. Uh, if you do have the a desire for the S Pen, you can now have it uh, in the Note 8. All right, guys? And uh, that's basically it. So, as I said, I'm going to be getting the Samsung Galaxy Note 8. It's going to be my daily driver. I'm going to be using that S Pen extensively. And I hope I can get some really good quality shots from the dual angle uh, dual uh, dual lens camera not that the SA plus is bad in any way but let's see what that extra addition of the lens and the combined power of two lenses can do so let me know what you're gonna be doing uh, maybe you are the S8 plus owner and maybe you don't want to upgrade because it's not a big deal the S-Pen is not a big deal for you uh, maybe you don't have the SA plus or the Note 8 and you're trying to make a decision I would say again the S8 Plus is going to have some good sales going on. Even now, you can get an S8 Plus for in the, in the range of $700. So that's much cheaper than a Note 8 that is fresh on the market. You're going to have to pay the full price. So just keep that thought in mind. I'm pretty sure if you go to Amazon.com right now, the S8 is $550 and the S8 Plus is $650. But if you try to pre-order the, uh, the Note 8 or buy the Note 8, it's going to be in the range of 800 to 900 bucks. It's going to fluctuate based on sales here and there. All right, so let me know what you're going to be doing. And uh, also, the iPhone 8 is up around the corner, so maybe some people are actually waiting for the iPhone 8 to make a final decision. That's also going to be an explosive phone. Uh, it's going to have a lot of uh, new features, relatively new features, uh, on it. So just drop your comments down below and let me know what you're going to be doing. And also, you can let me know how you feel about the Note 8. Okay, just got released. A lot of people watched the event. They told me in my private messages. And uh, some people are not that excited. Some people are very excited. So you can let me know down below how you feel. Now, make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Or a thumbs down if you hate it. And of course, subscribe to Saki Tech. Uh, for more videos to come and like I said there's gonna be a lot of videos dropped on the Note 8 the moment I get my hands on an actual unit and if you do use Instagram or if you do use Twitter make sure to follow me on both at Saki Tech Online guys have a fantastic day